The HVAC system is the largest contributor to your energy bill and the sole provider of comfort to everyone inside. Today Think Green is in this home for a reason. It is equipped with the highest technology in HVAC. A new system has replaced the old and the energy bills have gone down. Now that's thinking green. Today on Think Green, we have Dana Clark from Nordine, a company making energy efficient AC systems, including the IQ Drive, which is the most efficient AC system out there. Welcome to Think Green. Well, thank you for having me. Mari, if you haven't been doing any research or seriously shopping for a new heating and air conditioning system, let's say within the past five years, you'd be very surprised to discover just how well the latest technology can create a very comfortable indoor environment for you. We're going to look at some technology that not only is very energy efficient, can provide more stable, more balanced temperatures inside your home, but it also performs all of its duties while being very quiet. You mentioned better air balance. How does that work in the HVAC system? I think you'd be surprised to find out that roughly 80% of all homes in the United States actually have an incorrectly sized heating and air conditioning system. And part of the problem with having an incorrectly sized system will create poor indoor air quality, the system will be very inefficient, and you'll either have a condition where the system runs non-stop and never seems to shut off, or it will start and stop, start and stop. The IQ Drive air conditioner or heat pump actually thinks while it's in operation. It pretty much decides what is the most optimal point that I need to be operating at so that you get the greatest level of comfort inside your home. A big factor in terms of indoor air quality inside your home has a lot to do with humidity control. And part of the specialty of IQ Drive equipment is humidity control inside your home. Now, what should we look for in a contractor to make sure that the system is getting properly installed? That's a great question. It's very important that you select a contractor that understands the importance of doing a complete load calculation for the heating and air conditioning system that your home would require. You also want to look for a contractor that will hold any current state, local, or federal licensing. I think it's also very important that you look for a contractor that stays current with any industry certification or special factory certification. That way you know that they have the training that helps to make them a specialist in the heating and air conditioning equipment that you would have installed in your home. And you really want to try to avoid anyone that would want to give you an estimate over the telephone. What are some of the other tips that we can give our homeowners as far as choosing the best possible HVAC system for their home? You want to get the highest energy efficiency that you can afford. Air conditioners are rated by SEER, heat pumps are rated by SEER as well as HSPF. And that's really like miles per gallon on a car. The higher the number, the greater the energy efficiency. You want to ensure that your system has been properly sized for your home. You want to look for features like variable speed or multi-stage operation. That will allow the equipment to not only be efficient, but run quietly and provide good indoor air quality and provide more balanced temperatures throughout the home. You want to look for things like a good long warranty. Think about long-term energy cost savings. Always do your research. Thanks, Dana. Those tips were very helpful. Now, how does a homeowner get educated on the cooling and heating processes and, of course, which systems are eco-friendly and are more efficient? There's a lot of great opportunities out there. EnergyStar.gov, uh, certainly there are manufacturers' websites. There's also IQDrive.net. That's a really good one as well. Terrific tips. Thank you so much, Dana. Sure. You can also find that link on designingspaces.tv where you can click on the Think Green section to see this part of the show again. Of course, you can use this information to make your home more comfortable and energy efficient. For Designing Spaces Think Green, I'm Mari Monge in Parkland, Florida.